I'm a doctor. Let me take a look. Let me take a look. His jugular vein's been cut. Does anyone have a clean cloth? Please, someone. I have a fresh change of clothes in my bag. That's great. You're killing him. I'm saving his life. He was bleeding out. No, you have it in the wrong place. I think I remember enough of anatomy 101 to know what the jugular vein is. You would be in the right place if he were an adult. He's not an adult. He is a boy, which means you're also putting pressure on his trachea, which means he's not currently breathing. You have to put the pressure higher up. There. <gasps> Some glass. He'll be fine. Who are you? Hello. I'm Dr. Sean Murphy. I'm a surgical resident at San Jose St. Bonaventure Hospital. And the boy's left arm are popping. Is that bad? I, I don't see. Intrathoracic pressure. No, his chest is rising. He's breathing. No, the, the, the chest is moving paradoxically. The left lung is in distress. Yes. Who here has a sharp knife? Blade five inches or longer? Nobody? You should start artificial respiration. He's going to start breathing very soon. should take place two ribs down. The air will continue to leak and accumulate until the damage can be properly repaired. The tube allows the air to get out, the water in the bottle stops the air from coming back in. A homemade one way valve. <laughs> He's breathing. <laughs> he saved his life. He saved his life. 